Hey guys, this is Zach Chris in the house, and you are watching Linda, aka the Gamer Girl. Back to you. Hey everybody, Linda, aka the Gamer Girl here, and Reggie was watching TikTok, as always, and I just glanced down at the phone and saw PETA. And I was like, what is this? So, PETA decided to demonstrate and ask Blathers to empty the tanks. Okay. PETA, why are you doing this? Okay, for one, Blathers does not encourage you to do anything. You have to agree to do that. For one, so why are you yelling at Blathers? It makes no sense at all. It's a fake character, and he's an owl. He's an animal. You're yelling at an animal. Why? For what? Okay. That's so hypocritical. <laughs> Peta, I like you. I, I, I don't know what happened with Animal Crossing. I didn't say something the first time. When you made your document of, like... I don't know how many pages on why you should not do what it is meant to do, which is don't fish, don't catch anything, leave everything the way it's supposed to be, and let the harmonious island live, but it's fake. Being honest, PETA, Animal Crossing is a good thing. Yes, you say it will teach people that fishing is okay, and this is okay, and that's okay, but no. In reality, I'm bored out of my mind. And... I, I came from Colorado. So when we were bored out of our minds and we couldn't do anything and stuff was closed for some reason or another, which has happened a couple times, the only thing that was open would be the reservoirs or the lakes or whatever, and you had to stay whatever amount of feet away. We go fishing. So I can do that now in my island. And I can fish and I can catch bugs and I can do stuff and not destroy anything in our real planet. So, another thing I want to point out. Did one of your team members catch all the fish? Or did you storm somebody's island and mess with somebody? You know what I'm saying? So, either, either, that's, that's another hypocritical thing. One of your team members had to catch every single thing or a few fish to be able to make this demonstration. So you're basically doing the opposite of what you're telling us not to do, which is go through and not catch anything to do the fake demonstration. <laughs> so you, in turn, are doing what we're not supposed to do. It's like somebody saying, don't smoke, and they have a cigarette in their hand. You're telling the kid, don't smoke, don't be like me, but I have a cigarette in my hand. So why are you telling me not to catch fish when I can clearly see that all of you have a DIY PETA shirt, little, little, I don't know those, how you make a PETA shirt. So somebody in your team made the PETA shirts, then somebody else made all the fish be caught and you caught only a few of them, but still you caught them. You still caught them in, you said you want to cancel blathers. Why would you cancel Blathers? Makes no sense whatsoever because I, as the player, have to decide to go and give anything to Blathers. He's there for five seconds telling you something. I could ignore him and in turn have no museum, have no anything. And you don't even complain about the insects is another thing. You don't complain about me stealing fine art or the insects or the fossils and digging it up. And <laughs> it's like, oh, PETA, 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 PETA. I like you, PETA. That's why I didn't say anything the first time when I saw the document. I was like, oh, it's a, a good laugh. I, uh, I laughed with my friends and we made a joke about it. But, oh, my word, PETA. Uh... Hashtag blathers is over party is not going to work. You know? <laughs> it's not going to work. 
Oh, man. So, please stop yelling at a fake owl, for one. It, it, it just makes it look ridiculous. And two, tell your team members just to stop catching fish. How about that? So, I'm going to call it a day. Um, I'm going to go back to actually playing Animal Crossing. And, uh, PETA, hopefully you understand that it's just a game. And you're probably going to rebuttal, and maybe be in my comment section, but FYI, it really is just a game. It really is keeping our sanity and keeping everybody from realizing what's going on in the world. Kids are all over the world having a horrible time, seeing news that they don't want to see. And I don't think they need to see this on TikTok where they're being told not to play a game that is calm and relaxing. And please, PETA and anybody who is re representing PETA, don't storm islands. Don't storm people and bother them. Because all it's going to do is just get you kicked out of everything <laughs> and probably reported. <laughs> oh, my word. Uh, how do you guys feel about this? Uh, I want to hear your take on this. And also, have you had anybody that's represented by PETA come to your island and say anything? Because if they were at my island making a big fuss about it, I would literally be yelling at them through that where they said, empty the tanks. I would be saying something to them. And in fact, saying, yell at me. Don't yell at the fake thing. <laughs> I would stick up for blathers because technically I was part of the, I was an enabler and a part of the problem. So thank you guys for watching. If you're new, hit the sub button. Helps out the channel. And as always, keep on gaming, everybody. And I'll catch you next video. Why, pedo? Why? <laughs> Bye, guys. Linda, the gamer girl. She's here, she's playing games. Linda, the gamer girl. She's here, she's playing games too.